Hi, it's Tiziana. So today I thought I would do nail art. My nails are naked, so I want to do nail art. But before I start with the nail art, I wanted to show a really beautiful polish I got. It's a topper, but I have, I have looked at this polish for a very long time. But I thought I would never be able to get it because it's from Clean Color and uh, Clean Color doesn't send internationally. So I have been watching this polish for so long. But then I found a German site, uh, online site that sells Clean Color. And I was like, yes, then maybe they have the one that I really want. And yes, they did. And look at this topper. It is extremely beautiful. I'll show you a photo here. So this photo you're watching right now, this is the one that has inspired me to get this polish. I love this kind of glitters that are really, really small. This one is called Chunky Holo Purple. So I did swatch it over some purple. You can put it on any color you want. And then I love these clean color uh, bottles. Anyway, so then I found in my shopping center, I found another essence. This one is called, can't really find the name, is something with uh, Mickey and Friends. Mickey and Friends, Disney Mickey and Friends. Let's watch it. Oh, it's a really beautiful, rusty, but light, not a, like a dark rusty, a light rusty. Oh, and then there is, wow, it's really, really beautiful color. I'll show it to you closer now. There's a lot of red in it. I think some of the essence, even though it's a, at least here in Europe, it's a very cheap brand. It's uh, sometimes they make astonishing colors, really. And uh, so cheap, so cheap. And then I can want to swatch this one. This one I bought it together with the a polish I showed last time. I bought this one on Rainbow Connection. It's, it's from Swamp Gloss. I don't remember. The, in my last video I showed a polish. Um, so I bought it together with that polish. So it's around four months ago. But I haven't swatched it yet. This one is called You Ain't Seen Bad Boys. So I remember now, it's, uh, I bought it together with the Lumen. Oh, I love these kind of, I like to say delicate colors, like, yeah, I like to call them delicate because they're so light. This is extreme beauty in my eyes. So, so beautiful. So the polish I'm going, going to be putting on my nails today is not a new polish, but I have never used it. Bought it long time ago. Well, not that long, but a while back anyway. Uh, it's from China Glaze. And I thought this color would be good for Halloween. It has shimmer in it or glitter. I don't know what this is, you say, but so this one is called Trendsetter and uh, applying it on my nails now and then I'll make some nail art. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. It's very easy to work with. The formula seems to be good.
So this is how it looks now. Lina stamping plate, make your mark, 02. I'll be using Twinkle T stamper. And Born Pretty White. So I have these stickers, small flowers, and I'll be using this for his eyes. So I've seen it's pretty popular with this kind of hippie skulls. I've seen a lot of pictures on, I think it was Instagram, or actually different places I've seen them. I thought I would do my version. So I have some Conard black and I just want to paint the, the nose black. Just like that. And I did use, if somebody's wondering, Kolinsky brush. A very thin one. Neon orange from Mundo de Unas. And then I just a yellow from uh, AliExpress. And a purple from Color Alike, Sweet Dreams. And a red from, uh, I think this one is Esmalte de Kelly. It's called Morango. Nicole Diary, green. So with these colors, I'm just going to make some random spots over the skull. 